So I'm getting rid of my Nexus 6P by getting the LG V20. Because I hate this one. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> All right, so we are. Uh, I was gonna say hell no. <laughs> like yeah, like four five, four months later, get a new phone. Um, you get you have a new phone. The LG V20 just came out like last week, a couple days ago, and you are replacing your Droid Turbo because it sucks. Because it's a terrible phone that keeps lagging. What exactly was wrong with it? So. Sometimes when the phone was on, at around 30% to 20%, it would just automatically shut off. For and no reason. For no reason. Mm -hmm. And then when I turn it on, when I try to turn it on, it says 0% battery. And like 20 minutes later, it says that there's battery now. All right. That was one problem. The biggest problem, though, I've had since the first, since, uh... Well, after the first five months of having it, where it was the Droid Turbo, if sometimes would not read the SIM card, and so the only options were to do were replace it or try to keep resetting it until it finally read read the SIM card. And I also want to not add removing that SIM card or uh, what's called blowing on the SIM card would not work. It was just it's just a mo the motherboard problem. And I had to replace it four times. But so. I also, but I also want to add as well that uh, because you got the ballistic nylon version of the phone, you couldn't replace the <laughs> yeah, back of it. So you couldn't, you couldn't take off the battery cover to replace the battery because there was something obviously wrong with the battery. And then at the same time, could you actually take the SIM card out? Would it allow you to do that? Yeah, but you okay. couldn't. You couldn't take out the battery. You couldn't take out the battery, which so you. It was pretty much like unless you like freaking. Also, I Fry think, it open. I think it, I think because it was that ballistic nylon version that more heat got trapped in the phone, and so probably would, caused it to heat up more, and then yeah, because that's up the motherboard. Would it get like very hot sometimes? Yeah, yeah. <sighs> Let's add it add it to the case. So anyway, don't tell been, Verizon. <laughs> Verizon's like the biggest bullies in the cell phone network. I mean, they have they have the coverage from uh, you know around the United States at least, which is why most of the people migrate over to them. But as of like recent a couple months ago t-mobile actually passed them in top lte speeds so they're actually number one almost in terms of like cell phone speeds they, they narrowly beat to t-mobile honestly Shit. so i think there's a cool shift that's going to happen because verizon's like the biggest bullies when it comes to cell phone service and i'm, I'm happy i left them because you know i have google's project Fi, and that's okay it's not the best but it's also not the worst um i'm pretty i'm pretty happy for it for the most part you know you get what you pay for after all but um, Verizon is a CDMA network, so you have to buy their specific phone, so it's not like you can buy some unlocked phone. So you are getting the LG V20, and you're very excited. You've been following this phone for quite some time, right? What? <laughs> You've been following what? the phone for quite some he time. He says that. I just decided to buy it. Just, yeah, just, just randomly. Yeah. yeah, I was thinking about getting the Droid Turbo 2. Oh, perfect, yes. Because, you know, you the first one the made double. me really want to get the second one. Mm -hmm. exactly. <laughs> Amazing. So I went to get the ballistic nylon again. <laughs> when we when we went to see Yesta, we checked out the V10, right? Yeah, it was the V10. And uh, you liked that phone. They actually I the, really liked the, the V10. Girl, the girl, the LG spokeswoman there gave us a quick demonstration of it. You were really impressed. And I was playing around with it for a good like 20 minutes. Mm -hmm. But you were still on your moved. you were still on your contract, so you couldn't get a new phone. Yeah. So and also, I don't know if you, I don't know if you guys remember. I don't know if I forgot if it was in the video or not, but halfway through the first day of CES, my phone shut down on me, and it was not going off for the rest of the first day. Which is and not then the second day, same thing. Which is not something that you want to happen when we're halfway when we're in a different state and we're the only two people there. We want to be able to get oh, in contact with one another. It's we annoying. Lose, we lose each other at a big convention like CES. It was literally like it's like ah oh, shit. I, I'm. <laughs> I'm not exactly. All right, so we're gonna we get had to, to find a meetup spot. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna get to unboxing the phone right now. Um, pretty pretty cool. I'm gonna let Jacob unbox it since it is his phone, and uh, we'll move on from there. All right. Okay, so starting off with the unboxing of the LG V20, we have the main box here, which is just kind of white and plain. You turn it around, you just kind of see how it looks and stuff. Don't show them. That's your like address on there, right? There you go. <laughs> Um, so, so it says... Find me, I dare you. <laughs> so it says, uh, really quickly, um, here's what it comes with. 
the actual phone, a pre-installed SIM card, a standard lithium-ion battery, a wall slash USB charger, the quick reference guide. It's the basic stuff that you get when you get a phone. So there you go. And uh, now you can unbox it. See, it's okay, see guys. It I've had a lot of training of unboxing since the last time. Okay, still having technical oh, come difficulties. Come on, <laughs> <laughs> just kidding. Ooh. All right, so what does it say on the front? Life's good when you play more. Oh, their slogan, yeah. <laughs> Guess who's gonna download a lot of I games? I hate, I hate that this? they they made they they changed from being like a, a really ooh, they they changed it from being like a really flashy like cool kind yeah, of baby. type of shard style. Um, like from the LG G3 and LG G4, and then when the G5 came out, they're like, "Oh, we're gonna have it do fun and playful we're things." Have to cut, the, cut the tape. <laughs> so, all right, we got the phone itself. You got the. Uh, can, can I pull it out? <laughs> go ahead. It's your your unboxing. Yeah. You got the silver version, right? What's what's the official color name? I got know? the black one. No, what's the official? As you can see, it's black. What's the official color name? You don't know. I did not check. You didn't. Did you just? I just. I just made sure it wasn't black. Okay. <laughs> not racist. I know. Thing, I know. Saying. I know the black was supposed to be like titanium. It was supposed to be called titanium. So, all right. What do we have there? Did they give me an extra battery pack. What is that? Yeah, it looks like. No, it looks, just looks like the battery itself. <laughs> We got some. Is that USB Type C? Spoiler alert! USB Type C. Yes, it is. So you get the spoiler. latest, latest standard. Don't you guys for USB love your spoilers? spoilers. They and my, then they love my spoilers. <laughs> and then go. We have the wall charger here. Dude, this just felt like a spring for a second. It's a plain white ordinary wall charger. Can you pull it off. Well, actually, the USB port's on the side. You can see that. Yeah, I saw it. So that's pretty Fast cool. Fast charge. Wait, wait. Well, all of them have fast volt. charge because it is USB C. It does charge faster, so it's just mm -hmm. it's just typical. A lot of it. It's I like think, as fast as my power bank. Yeah, it's pretty standard these it's days good. for newer phones. You know how much over there? Hand me the battery for a sec. We got. Oh, you know, unwrap it. Mm. On the battery, it says. Is that? Yeah, life's good when you play more. Nah, 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 nah. So, what's the size here? 3,200 milliamp hours. So, it's a pretty decent size. My Nexus is 3,450 milliamp hours. So, pretty good. And, uh, it's just minimum 3,080 milliamp hours. Alright, so pretty cool is your standard official LG V20, um, battery. I believe that it's also a bigger size battery than the G5, if I'm not mistaken. But this thing's not modular like the G5 is. Alright, so, take, uh... Take the phone out. You, what are you putting right there? A lot of gaming apps. What? Just unbox the freaking phone. I'm gonna download Kingdom Hearts Unchained. I'm sorry. Who cares? <laughs> <laughs> well, that one didn't have enough. Who just, 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 just do it. I swear. All right, so we got the phone itself. Whoa, whoa, whoa! There is a manual. We must look through every page of the manual before we touch that phone. Everyone agree? Yeah, yeah, I believe so. Meet your phone. Hello, phone. Wait, wait, wait. Does this say, does that the black version titanium on the? It does. <laughs> they even changed the instruction booklet depending is on what color difference? you have the phone. And not not that there's any torches so besides the colors. So you're telling me if I get the black one, it's gonna be silver? I'm just just kidding. It's just it, <laughs> no, it's titanium. But it's funny. That I thought they would change the pictures at least for the manuals, but no. I guess they didn't want to spend the extra money. All right, we skimmed it. It's right. good enough. So we got the phone itself there. You know, actually, there is one thing I should check. What is that? <laughs> how to put the battery? <laughs> how do you not know how to put the battery? What? 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 Seriously? Are you seriously looking up right now? Does it look like there's a battery opening slide thingy? Just. Put the battery out on the side. It should be like a little Ooh, tab. It should be a tab. This it? I don't know if that's it. This is it. There. I guess that's it. Wink, wink. Just kidding. Found it. I can't believe you were about to open up the manual. Who opens up the manual, right, you guys? Obviously, you obviously you just put, it, just put the battery. No, in. it was a wink, wink. I just, swear. Some boxing's really It was right. a wink, wink. 
Alright, so pretty simple. Is it pretty lightweight oh. with the battery in there? So when you press the bottom, you have to press the top and the left side too. Yeah. Just pressing the left side. Well, I, well, I hope so, you know. Um, is that is it pretty light already? I like it. With the battery? Now let's take everything off of it. No. I'm sorry, but I don't take anything off until I get my screen case. My case your and my... case and your screen protector? Yeah. Which case are you going to go for? Have you even taken a look? I'm probably just going to... I might not even get a case for this phone. I might just get the screen protector. Oh. See, I don't... I don't even Since have it's it. all metal, People there's think not really a point. I just don't like it. The one thing I hate about messing up my phones is having scratches on the edges. And I've seen that on a lot of people. And sometimes oh, yeah. I've seen the screen cracked. And well, the that is one thing I'm afraid of. It's always kids. Anyway, I, I never put... Joseph's the same age as me, and he dropped his freaking because Samsung. Because he's stupid. Well, he, he has a Samsung. You have curved glass on that phone. <laughs> no, I don't think there's anything else in there. No. Oh, my God. There's a bunch of folded bo box paper. All right. So, here. do you want to turn it on? More at folded box paper. Screen? Do you at least want to show it up how it boots and stuff? Is there a power button? Holy shit, oh so it is a double screen, uh, and uh, interesting point to note is that it's not an OLED screen, which I don't know why, again, LG decides to not go with an OLED screen. I mean, they push their OLED TVs so much, and then they have phones, and their phones are not OLED screens. So regardless, I, I, it does, I did hear that it does look better than the... Uh, uh, my hand. Then the LG G3, which I had, which was the first 1440p display, um, which is nice. So, but it is LCD. All right, so that's it for the unboxing. Uh, let's set it Let up everything. Let me call. Let me call. All right, so we're gonna we're gonna head out. Jacob's gonna play with the phone, and uh, we'll have a good time. All right. Thanks for watching.